Hi guys, welcome to the channel and kaboom! Yes, welcome to my Made Simple Attack strategy series. And guys, just picture this. About a week ago, I was just relaxing in the Legend League with Mike the Minion when suddenly, boom, my base was three-starred by an absolutely crazy attack strategy. I thought, wow, this is so good. We've got to make a video on it. So today, guys, we're going to check out this absolutely amazing attack strategy. First of all, we're going to rename the army. We can't call it Yeti Storm, no. We're going to call it La Lo. Bats. Yes, I'm a very slow typer. Sorry, with three exclamation marks. So let's meet the troops, guys. You're going to have six Lava Hounds, including Larry the Lava Hound, and 20 Balloons. That's it. It shouldn't work, but it does. The spells are the key to this strategy, though. You're going to have Bat spells, guys. Six, seven, or eight Bat spells. You'll see from the replays. I sort of uh, change it up a little bit, but you need at least sort of six Bat spells, three Freeze, and one Rage spell. Your donated Clan Castle troops are going to be nine Balloons, and they're going to fit inside a Battle Blimp, guys. Yes! And a donated spell will be a Rage spell to sprinkle on top. That's the army. Like I said, it shouldn't work, but it does. And when it does, it's so much fun. Wow. So we're going to check out some replays now, and I'll show you how to use it. Let's go. So here we go, guys. Here's our first replay. And we do have several replays today. Legend League attacks, war attacks. So do stick around so you get a full understanding of how to use this amazing strategy. So this base, we're going to attack from the opposite side. So... Lava Hounds down first, in a line. Yes, this is an air spam attack. Then the balloons behind. Grand Warden in the middle, and then the Battle Blimp. We need to get that Battle Blimp across the base and take down the Town Hall. So use the Grand Warden ability to protect it just when it's reaching sort of the edge of his aura. There we go. And the Battle Blimp is sailing across the base. Get ready with that Rage Spell above the Town Hall, guys. So the balloons, when they come out of that Battle Blimp, will take down the Town Hall. No messing. Any second now. Goodbye, Town Hall. And then, guys, the bats, of course. It's up to you. There's two ways to use the bats, depending on the base. You can either put them in with the troops initially, with the balloons and the lava hounds, so they distract the defences, or you can hold on to them to later, when it's a bit safer to deploy them and use those free spells to freeze wizard towers, scatter shots. It's up to you. When you've used this strategy for a while, you'll get a feeling of when to put the bats in. Sometimes, though, you can use this strategy with 11 bat spells, 9 bat spells, 10 bat spells, guys. It's awesome. So here we go. The Royal Champion was protected with the initial Grand Warden ability. She's made her way through the base. And guys, as you can see, this is going to be really good. Sometimes with the initial attack here, we didn't really use the heroes. Sometimes on some bases, you can use the heroes early to take out uh, an air sweeper, an air defense. You know, see if you can get a scatter shot, take out the enemy queen. That's a priority. But there we go, guys. There's the first replay. So yes, it's a beautiful spam attack and it shouldn't work. But it does. And when I got three starred in the Legend League, I just saw it and I was like, wow, yeah, this is a good attack strategy. So here we go. Here's one of the recent Clan War League. Uh, this was me and my second account attacking the opposition. My clan mates uh, thought it was a joke. And I said, no, just watch this strategy, guys. We can do it. So it's really effective coming in from the opposite side to the town hall. Those air sweepers are pointing up. So we're going to be coming in from this sort of bottom side here. There we go. I've put the king in on one side. So we'll put the heroes in early this time. So the king's going to sort of uh, clear a, a bit of a funnel over there. Remember, the balloons will only go for defences initially. Queen on the right-hand side. And uh, just relax now, guys. You know, half the battle with attacks is remaining calm and relaxed. I don't. I'm going to put one Lava Hound in there. I think I accidentally pressed on the screen. I don't think I meant to put that Lava Hound down. I honestly think I just tapped the screen by accident. Rest of the Lava Hounds down, then the balloons. There we go. Where's the Grand Warden? There he is. And just take your time now. Put the Royal Champion in as well. We can protect her in a moment. There's the Battle Blimp. And just as it gets to the edge of the Grand Warden's aura there, ability hit there. That's protecting the Royal Champion as well. She can go over and take out the Eagle Artillery. Then we're going to send in the Bats. And the Bats, guys, they're going two different ways. Lovely. Now that scatter shot is trying to look at my Bats, but we're saying no. And it just looks like it's not moving now. It doesn't know what to do. And then, of course, the Rage Spell down on the Town Hall. Take that out. And the bats can just help out. You know, if you just put your bats down without thinking about it, it is down to look a bit where the bats go. Will they run into a wizard tower? Will they run into a scatter shot? So like I said, you can either put them down initially with a spam attack to distract the defences or hold on to them if you feel confident. And then you can manually put down the free spells to try and clean up the base. You know, and that looks a bit more professional, doesn't it, guys? And here we go, the Royal Champion again. I've poisoned that nasty wizard tower and the enemy queen. 
Uh, can we take out the king? I don't know. The royal champion's trying to move away, but the king is after her. And those lava pups are saying, no, leave our royal champion alone, please, Mr. King. And, uh, yep, lava pups. They're quite magnificent creatures, aren't they? And uh, there's a few of them there on the left-hand side. We've lost all our bats, which is a shame. And uh, I know some of you might be upset that there's no Mike the Minion in this attack strategy, guys. But uh, the Lava Hounds wouldn't work with him. Larry the Lava Hound is in charge of the Lava Hounds. He said, I'm not working with Mike again. We've had an argument. As you know, Mike the Minion, yeah, he does get angry sometimes and fall out with the other troops. But, uh, you know, he's very good and... I think that bit of jealousy there. Anyway, sorry, back to the battle there. La look at the little lava pups. How cute are they? Look at their faces. Amazing. There we go. So uh, I don't know what happened there. I think I dropped my phone. Sorry for that, guys. Uh, so we've got another replay now, I believe. Yeah, this is from the Legend League. So centralized town hall base. Just showing that it's not always sort of anti-three-star bases. These sort of centralized town hall bases. We can take them out, guys. Don't worry. So I want it, So like I said earlier, I'm going to put my king and queen in because I want to take out those wizard towers. My bats have just said to me, they've said moose, and I've said yes, bats. And they said, listen, we don't like wizard towers. And I said, I know. Can you put the king and queen in to try and take out those wizard towers? And I said, yes, let's do that. I listen to my troops, guys. I listen. Out come some ice golems. It's okay, though. Don't worry. So the queen's taking out those two wizard towers over there. That's good. That's a good start to the battle. Let's have a look at the air sweepers. Okay, they're down there. And now let's just go for it. So there we go. Lava Hounds down. Then the balloons. And guys, watch this replay here. It goes very well. So Lava Hounds, look at them all in on that one air defense. So yeah, I could have probably put them out uh, separated a bit better than that. Then we put uh, the Battle Blimp down. Get ready with the Grand Warden ability. There we go. Doesn't that look nice and beautiful? All those balloons glowing. We need to get that Battle Blimp to the Town Hall. Get ready with the Rage Spell. There we go. And yes... As soon as it makes it there, we should have enough to take out the town hall. The only thing, of course, if it hits a sort of a tornado trap just before, then you could be in trouble. So this time, I'm trying to strategically put the bats down. We've uh, got more free spells. I've had four free spells this time. Like I said, guys, play around with your spells a bit. As long as you've got at least five or six bat spells and three free spells plus, there we go. So here we go. I'm freezing those nasty defenses, that scatter shot there. I really want those bats to sweep through and take out the scatter shots. Yes! There we go. We've got one wizard tower over there on the right, and we've got one free spell left. There we go. And this time we've managed the bats through the base. So I know, guys, that using lava hounds and loons scares some people. I can't get uh, Lalo or Laloon. Um, I know it's such a powerful attack. Trick. I can't get it to work. I just can't. I panic. I don't know I, I yeah. So anyway, this is a strategy that works for me. It's my version, my spam attack version of uh, getting this to work. And listen, at this point I was thinking, no, that queen's been really annoying. But look, the bats and the lava pups have worked together there. That is a dream team in action. Look, they're coming together there for the three stars. I love teamwork. There we go. Well done, guys. Well done. So I hope you're enjoying the replays. I do believe this is the last replay. Another Clan War League attack. This second time, though, I think my clan mates had a bit more um, confidence in the attack. So, we're going to use our heroes. What are we going to take out? So, it's the scatter shot over there. We need to get rid of that. Um, yeah. So, we're just uh, surveying the battlefield, guys. Take your time. So, we're going to put the king down there and the queen. I want to take out the enemy queen, if possible. And there's a scatter shot on the left. So can we three-star this base to finish off? Would I show you a one-star attack with this? Probably not. So we are going to three-star the base. So I'm going to put a Lava Hound over there on the left to keep that single-target Inferno occupied. And over on the right as well, of course. Long line of balloons there. There's the Battle Blimp. And we're going straight for the Town Hall. Grand Warden ability used. We've got seven Bat Spells, one Poison Spell this time, and three free spells. There we go. Rage Spell on the Town Hall. Goodbye, Town Hall. Goodbye. Nice knowing you. And in come the bats. Uh, guys, yeah, I was a bit slow on the free spell there. They were just flying into a wizard tower. I That wasn't good. We're going to freeze the scatter shot to Expos up there for the Royal Champion. We really need her to take them out if she can. And it looks like she will do. And those bats are going to help out. Wizard tower there. I can see you. Get rid of that free spell. But we haven't got one. So we're in trouble here, guys. And we do get a bit lucky. That wizard tower is preoccupied with the Royal Champion. And the bats just swoop in. And take it out. And there's nothing left to hurt the bats now. So at this point, you know it's going to be three stars. Um, we did get a little bit lucky there. I ran out of three spells. The Royal Champion came. To it wasn't luck. It was skill. I planned it. No, I didn't. So now it's just cleanup time. 
Who's left? Uh, Royal Champion. Yeah, we're, we're poisoning you guys. Sorry, I never like poisoning uh, the opposition heroes. And those bats are now relentlessly attacking the Royal Champion. She's gone. And the poor king, he's trying to run away. But he can't do anything. Uh, those bats, no mercy there. Uh, the queen. I forgot about the queen. And she's even got a little lava pup with a, a pet lava pup. That is adorable. Look at that. What a team. That is really nice to see. Uh, the queen. and uh, That is uh, Lawrence the lava pup. Oh, isn't that sweet, guys? There we go. There we go. So hope you enjoyed the video today. Do remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Join the Smooth Army, guys, if you'd like to see more replays. And do remember, we have a creator code. So if you'd like to support this channel in-game, go to settings, scroll down more settings, scroll down support to creator, and input the code Moose, and you'll help support the channel. It does need... Uh, what am I trying to say there? Yeah, it... Uh, guys, I've lost the ability to speak. Uh, you need to put it in every week. Otherwise, it expires. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, take care now. Smooth signing out. I'll see you in a bit.